so on the first of June at nine in the morning. 六月一日，呃，早晨九点的时候。As I got quiet before the presence of the Lord. 当我啊、呃、安静在神的面前，神的同在当中。I found my soul caught up to heaven. 我发现主把我的灵提到天上去。You may have heard me say this repeatedly many times. 也许你们曾经听过我重复的说过 ，that I'm always caught up to go to this council of the prophets in heaven. 我经常被神提到天上的这个长老的会议里头 ，and this council composed of seven ancient prophets of Bible days. 这个啊会议里面有七个这个圣经里头的这些先知的会议。And their job is to oversee the end-time prophecies in the Bible and its fulfillment. 他们的责任就是要啊，确保圣经里头所有的这些预言将会来成就。So this council concerns of things that are related to the second coming of the Lord Jesus Christ. 所以这个会议是特地为着主耶稣基督再来的事情做预备的。And end-time prophecies concerning Israel and the nations of the world. 末日的预言啊，涵盖了以色列跟其他的列国。That is the specialty of this council. 这就是这个天上会议的一个特殊的任务。There are many councils in heaven. 在天上有很多的不同的会议。Because of my special calling, I am related to this particular council. 呃，因为我的特殊的呼召，我跟这个先知的啊会议是有特别的关系。And the chairman of this council is Abraham. 这个会议的主席是亚伯拉罕。So I was at this council. 我参与了这个会议。And Abraham looked at me and he said. 亚伯拉罕看着我说。At this open heavens prophetic conference. 在这个呃打开天门特会。You must teach one important thing. You 必须要教导一个很重要的事 That persecution is going to come. 就是逼迫将会来到 It's not just persecution in one nation. 不只是在一个某个国家的 But a world on a worldwide scale. 而是一个全球性的逼迫 The worldwide persecution that was prophesied by our Lord is going to be fulfilled. Very soon. 我们的主耶稣基督他亲口预言的末日的逼迫将会临到。This was just the two sentences they told me. 这是他们告诉我的这两句话。And the mood in the council was very somber. 在这个会议里头的整个的气氛氛围是非常的严肃。The other six members in the council never spoke a word. 其他的六位成员他们没有说一句话。But The mood was very serious and somber. 但是它整个的氛围是非常的沉重。And I also noticed some form of sadness on their faces. 我也从他们的脸上观察，看到他们带着一些忧伤。The sadness is not related to the coming persecution. 这个忧伤并不是关乎将要临到的逼迫。The sadness is because 他们带着的忧伤是因为。The believers are not ready. 信徒还没预备好。That is their sadness. 这是他们的忧伤。Persecution is coming. 逼迫将要临到。What many nations are experiencing now. 现在有许多国家正在经历到的。Is in a small scale. 只是一个小规模性的。Like the early rain. 就好像春雨，这初雨一样。But there's a later rain that will come. 但是还有这个秋雨将要临到。Take place on a major worldwide scale. 那将会是一个全球性的逼迫临到。Let me give you one example. 让我给大家一个例例证。Before the baby Moses was born, 在摩西啊出生之前 ，or just about that time when he was born， 就是正当他出生的时候 ，all male babies born in Goshen were killed. 在戈山出生的所有的婴儿都被杀。Goshen is a city. 戈山是一个城市。It is like a nation. 就就像是一个国家了。And this persecution came was for the whole nation. 这个逼迫来到是临到整个国家的。Every newborn baby, 所有出生的婴儿 ，was a martyr， 都是殉道者。Why？ 为什么呢
because one savior was coming. Before that savior came, 在这个救赎者临到之前, the martyr's blood was necessary. And then in Matthew chapter 2, you read, When the baby Jesus was born, the whole of Bethlehem, Every toddler from two years old and below were killed. Now what happened in Matthew 2 is not very far from where we are. That baby's thoughtless martyr's blood was shed in this land. The Bible does not record how many babies were killed. But one whole town full of thoughtless, zero to two years old were killed. Can you imagine? A river of blood flowed in Goshen. A river of blood flowed in Bethlehem. So much so, the scripture says, the spirit of Rachel came up and cried in the streets of Jerusalem. She stood there and she cried and she cried for the slain babies in Israel. The word says Rachel cried. But Jewish rabbis in their traditional teaching say the spirit of Rachel rose up and she stood there and she cried and she cried and she cried. That's uh, there you have two witnesses from the scriptures. Something that happened on a citywide, a nationwide scale. What happened in the past will be repeated again in the future. But again, as they were not prepared in the past, so will they not be prepared in the future. And But as those who were prepared were protected in the past, so will those who will be prepared will be protected in the future. 同样的，在过去虽然没有预备，但是受保护；在将来也同样的，虽然没有预备，同样受到保护。During the persecution in Goshen，在戈山的逼迫领导的时候，there were two groups of protectors，有两群的保护者。One was the midwives，一个就是这个收生婆。these midwives saved some babies. They were supposed to kill. But instead of killing, they saved the Hebrew boys. As a result, they were abundantly blessed. Just like the midwives who saved the babies, our dear Pastor Jose and his dear wife Stella have a similar call like that. To protect the Jewish people the Jewish people from persecution that is going to come. Then the other group is Moses family. So the families also need to protect one another. 
even to the extent of their own lives. 就算是他们要冒自己生命的危险。So such people must rise up. 所以那些人要被兴起。They will not care for their own lives. 他们不在乎自己的性命。But they will protect their family members. 但是他们会保护他们的家庭成员。Now the third group. 第三群人。The third group is found in Bethlehem. 是可以呃在这个啊伯利恒那里发现。Now Joseph is not directly related to the Lord Jesus. Joseph 跟主耶稣并不是直接相连的。So he is like the foster father. 他好像就是一个养父的身份。But he was born in a dream. 但是他在梦里面受到天使的提醒。And he carried the baby to Egypt. 他就把婴儿耶稣带到埃及。So this third group of People, so this third group of people will be a special breed of prophetic people. 将会是一个特殊的先知性的群体 Who will have supernatural experiences with God? 他们会从神那里经历超自然的经验 And they will supernaturally transport people from one location to another location. 他们会超自然的把人从一个地方提到另外一个地方 That is for the sake of hiding the chosen ones. 那是为了要特别保护他们，隐藏这些被拣选的。So that is why our dear brother, Dr. Bruce Allen, has this special call from God to give such teaching, teachings and prepare such a group of people. 这就是我们的艾伦博士他所领受的，要预备这这样的人，让他们有这样的经历。So persecution is coming. 所以逼迫将要临到。A worldwide persecution that is prophesied by the Lord is going to come. 神所主耶稣所预言的世界性的逼迫将要临到。You know, I was naturally shaken by that word. 我被这些话语真的震撼到了。But for the past few months, 在过去的几个月 ，Now this has never happened in my life before. 在我生命呃从从来没有发生过这些事情。This is the fortieth year of my ministry. 这是我服侍的第四十年。But in the last two months, 在过去的两个月 ，The Lord has been constantly speaking to me about persecution and martyrdom. 主不断的告诉我关于这个啊逼迫和殉道。He told me, "You must warn my people." 你必须要警戒我的百姓。That persecution is coming. 逼迫将要临到。You must prepare them for martyrdom. 你必须预备他们面对殉道。This is the two mandate I have received. 这是我从主所领受的两道命令。Prepare them for martyrdom. 预备他们面对殉道。Warn them of persecution that is coming. 警戒他们将要临到的逼迫。If you are warned, 如果你接受了提醒 ，you will seek the Lord what to do. 你会寻求主要如何做。There is a time to be slaughtered. 啊，受逼迫有时。There's a time to be imprisoned. 被囚有时。There's a time to be abandoned. 被弃有时 ，but before that time， 但是在那一段时间之前 ，you must be protected。你必须接受保护 ，you must stay hidden。你必须呃隐藏。If you read the life of the Lord Jesus， 如果我们读到耶稣基督的生平 ，three times it is recorded in the Gospels， 在福音书里面记载了有三次 ，that he hid himself， 他隐藏起来 ，he hid himself from the Pharisees。他从法利赛人的手中隐藏起来。But when his time came to die， 但是当他要受死的时间临到 ，he surrendered voluntarily。他就自愿的把自己。But before that time， 在那时间之前 ，he hid himself。他隐藏自己。So this is the wisdom we must have today。这是我们今天所必须拥有的智慧。That is why God called me to prepare. 这就是神呼召我来预备。That time is coming. 时候将到。If you are called to be a martyr, 如果你被呼召成为殉道者 ，then the preparations for a martyr. 作为殉道者所要做的预备 ，we should know that. 我们必须要知道。So when I came out of this vision, 当我从这个意象当中出来的时候 ，I was still Pondering over those words, 我还是在思想，反复的思想这些话语。And an hour later, at ten in the morning, 
the Lord Jesus came to me. And he explained further what the council told me. So I'm going to share with you exactly as how the Lord spoke to me. So I'm going to share with you exactly as how the Lord spoke to me. So I'm going to share with you exactly as how the Lord spoke to me. So I'm going to share with you exactly as how the Lord spoke to me. So I'm going to share with you exactly as how because it all started in Jerusalem when the first church in Jerusalem was born. This is where it started. And we'll go on full circle and come back to the same point again. So before worldwide persecution takes place, 因此在全球性的逼迫临到之前 ，it will begin here. 它会从这里开始 ，and then have a ripple effect. 然后有这个涟漪的这种影响扩散。If you read Acts chapter eight verse one, 如果我们读使徒行传第八章第一节 ，it says like this. 他这样子说 ，At that time, a great persecution arose against the church. Which was at Jerusalem, and they were all scattered throughout the regions of Judea and Samaria, except the apostles. From that day on, the Jerusalem church was persecuted. Outside the apostles, the Jews were scattered in Judea and Samaria. There is another version of this scripture. The Jewish version and another version. And only the Holy Spirit can open our eyes to see that way. 只有圣灵能够开启我们的眼睛看得到。Now this concerns the rapture. 这是关乎被提。At that time, there was a great rapture, and they were all taken up to heaven except some. 在那时候，有很一大群的人被提到天上，除了一些人之外。No, I'm not reading from X81. I'm reading from me. Ah, I'm from my heart. I'm saying it. I'm not talking about the eight verses. You know, not everybody will be raptured. Not everyone will be raptured. Some will be left behind. Some will be left behind. Why? 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 Why?